Chat, if you guys are stream hopping, I'm gonna ban the people who are. If you guys don't be annoying, guys. Just enjoy the roleplay. So did the DLC say they don't do those anymore? Or are they just gonna meet us there or what? I thought the uh, DLC They handles. said they do do them. Okay. So they're gonna meet us there or? Yeah, that's what they said. Okay. I, I was in the impression we had like a garage there, but I think we don't. I think we just have to park on the side and yeah, walk there's, in. Uh, yeah, there's a side door that we have to go into the holding area and bring them up from there. Okay. What is stream hopping when people who are diehard fans of a streamer they go and shit talk another streamer in their chat because their streamer that they die hard for uh, or like goes to jail? What happens a lot in the RP community for those who are new to the RP, uh, RP community. It's pretty lame. Make sure you guys drop a follow, by the way. Honestly, I'm gonna fucking shine in the courtroom. You guys think I can get my way out of this? You guys think I can get my way out of this chat? Yo, Aaron, thanks for that 13, bro. Chat, make sure you guys drop a follow on the channel, boys. We're almost at 180,000 followers, chat. I appreciate everybody hanging out today, hey, man. Uh, it's Ripley again. I just wanted to let I you know that we have I can't believe there's actually 13,000 of you in here. Uh, courthouse, and we'll be uh, bringing him into the courtroom to begin a bench trial. He has uh, suggested that he could uh, what's it, represent himself if he needs to. No, no, no. Uh, if the lawyer's not there, then yeah. Yeah. Larry Long, thanks for that. Oh, no, months. there's bugs in it? That's terrible. Get an exterminator. Uh, I don't know. I can't really offer you a taxi cab, but just get here as soon as you can, and uh, you can just come right in the courthouse. We'll be the one in the room. Okay, we'll see you. Bye-bye. All right. We don't have to wait for him, but he'll, he said he'll be here whenever he can, and he'll try to help. Uh, okay. I mean, how occupied is he? Completely free. He just, his car is completely destroyed, and he, he, has, to come up? <laughs> he has to run here. Um, yeah, actually, maybe Bison, you could give him a ride or something. That would be yeah, good to kind of get things... Uh, just call him back. His name is Bu He's in the yellow pages. Yo, hold it down, Marlo. Free my Please, fucking guys. Free my mans. That's free my saying. guys. Free, free my, my guys. Mans. Well, What's if it this? isn't the door, man, come to hold the door open, huh? Hey, is there a clothing store or somewhere I can get changed? Uh, I don't think there's one here, but I don't know much about this place. Hey, uh, Spencer, do you know if there's a place for people to get changed here? Uh, here I don't believe so. Your Honor. <laughs> Hello. Oh, How you doing, what the Your Honor? That was for yesterday. Hello. Yeah, I was coming here to make sure I could. So I can take this off? I can take off this dunce cap? Is it okay if I take this dunce cap off, Sergeant? Am I on the left or right side here? I don't remember. Okay. Yeah, you you're on the right here, side. Yeah. So I'm to make sure I can take can it off. Going, going. I don't want to get in trouble for wearing a hat I wasn't cleared to wear. Go free my boy, bro. Free oh my, my God, boy. Rhyming. I beg your pardon, Your Honor. Can you uncuff him? Yes, Your Honor. There you go. So All right. Pablo, get I, the car. I, what are you doing? Get back here. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Get back in there. I'm fucking around. I'm get fucking back around. In there. I'm fucking get your hands behind your back. I'm fucking around. Get your hands behind your back. Bro. I don't think so. I was no, I don't do jokes. I've What's got just a, a hat for him. I was joking around, Your Honor. I was just Your Honor, he tried to he goes. He tried to What's run, up? Your Honor. Your Honor, I was just I was just fucking around. All right, Sergeant, well, should I give you yeah, a hat? Up? I'm gonna give you one more chance. All right, of course, of course. Well, Your you Honor, run out of, you run out of this courtroom. I'm gonna give you 200 months and a ten thousand dollar fine. <laughs> yes, okay. sir. Your Honor, I would like to request that if. In, in exchange for agreeing to uncuff Rami again, that he has to wear a dunce cap for this bench trial, please? Uh, I'm going to deny that. Damn it. So, oh, I tried. I've got the hat already, Your Honor. So if you do run and you do get that time, don't be surprised. Okay. But see that all the gangsters pulled up to the fucking courtroom to hold him down for me, you know what I mean? Okay, is there, yeah, is there already like an incident report or something where I can see the charge? Uh, there is. Uh, it's blank as far as, you know, other stuff, but it's 2510. All right, Mr. Rami, resisting arrest, how do you plead? Not guilty. 
Misdemeanor possession of cocaine, how do you plead? Not guilty. Bribery, how do you plead? Definitely not guilty. You actually charged me with that? What the fuck is wrong with you? Yes. Even Tony Andrews told you not to fucking do it. Okay, everyone put their fingers up in the air. Fuck. Guys, like... You supposed to tell the truth, the whole truth, and that's the truth, and the penalties of perjury so help you coil. Yep. Okay. Uh, Mr. Ripley, let's hear your side of the story. This guy's actually just throwing charges on. Your Honor, trying to charge me with approximately 30 minutes ago, we were in the area of the Vespucci Canals attempting to uh, bring some fleek of bank robbers to justice. We had one of them in custody. His name is Uchiha Jones. Oh he ended God. up pleading guilty to all charges and is currently serving his time. Uh, as we were securing that scene, the accused, along with uh, Mr. Uh, K, Mr. Kebon, drove past, or what we call in the police uh, industry here, a slow-rolled our scene uh, in a uh, stolen vehicle. Uh, as I pulled up alongside them, I advised them to leave the area. Uh, they were both sitting unmasked in their vehicle and uh, said they would leave the area. Uh, at that time, having made a positive uh, identification on the driver, I uh, was aware that uh, Mr. Kebon had a Mr. Rami, felony Mr. warrant. Uh, I don't know. Mr. Preston? Good Are day, Preston? Your Honor. My name is Buford J. Preston Escobar. Ah. The J is for oh, justice. Thank fucking God. Yeah, he's here. Well, well, make sure you're yelling, Mr. Buford. Why, yes, uh, sir, Your Honor. I apologize. Uh, Can you hear me now, Your Oh, God. Thank you know God you showed up. Sir, do you mind if I request a short recess to discuss with my client the charges that have been brought against him? That's you actually a pretty good idea. five minutes. Yeah. Why, thank you, Your Honor. Uh, Your Honor, by the way, the uh, evidence is in the evidence locker hey, associated with the report boss? I gave you. Can you take a picture of that and put the picture inside the report? Nice to meet you, man. My uh, name yes, is yes. Uh, Rami Al Rahman. Yes, sir, Mr. Rahman, sir. My name is Buford J. Preston Esquire. As you heard, the J is for justice. Uh, I am here just in time to save you, sir. Listen, these cops are literally charging me with bullshit, right? This guy's- Are you aware of the charges that have been brought against you, sir? Yeah, yeah. He's charging me one time resisting arrest, one time possession of cocaine, and then one time bribery. Okay, first of all, I didn't even fucking bribe the guy. I'll tell you what happened. Basically, um, I, w I was in the passenger seat of a car. The guy who was driving had a warrant for his arrest. So they go and they, they go and try to pull him over, but the guy keeps the guy uh, a pedal to the metal and drives away. Okay. I'm not Excuse gonna... me, sir. Hold on, sir. What was the purpose of the traffic stop, sir? It wasn't the guy who was driving had a warrant. How do they know that, sir? I, I, you tell me. Fuck it. So they just pulled him over for no reason, sir. Yeah, they were like, oh, no, no. So we were going to fishing, and police were in the area. I don't know why. I guess they were like investigating something. We were, so we pulled up to the fishing spot, and then the, we asked them if we can get a fishing boat out because we we didn't want to interfere with their uh, with their stuff. And then the cop goes. Oh, actually, you can't go fishing, but the guy to the guy who was driving, he goes, you have a warrant for your arrest. Get out of the car. So the guy, the guy, instead of getting out of the car, he like he guns it and just drives away. Now, me, I'm not going to fucking jump out of a moving vehicle that go, that's going 100 miles an hour. I'm not trying to die. Yeah, of course. sir. Uh... So the guy ends up crashing the car and then uh, they all chase him and I go for I, I, and I just start walking away and I run away. All right. Oh, I, oh, I had oh, no so, reason. Oh, so, give me the name of the driver, please, sir. Mr. K. Mr. K, so okay. Yeah. So I did nothing wrong. I didn't have a warrant for my arrest. I, I didn't have any problems with it. You know, I, there's no reason for them to arrest me. So I just ran away. Then they started chasing me. They ran me over with their car and then tased me. Then I had a bag of cocaine on me. Now, the reason why I had a bag of cocaine on me is because Tony Andrews, the state trooper, hired me as a CI to uh, um, arrest somebody for him. So I was going to use the reason why I had that cocaine was I was going to use that cocaine to, uh, you know, um, get somebody arrested. And this officer, Andrew, sir, is he in the courtroom? No, he's not. And then on top of that, they arrest me. They take me to the fucking cells. And then Jack Ripley goes, the guy who's the guy who's on the other side of the desk. Jack Ripley doesn't Mirandize me at all. And then goes, oh, uh... uh Your Honor, the um, report has been updated with the uh, evidence and, uh... Yeah, can you whisper? Yeah, okay. So, the, uh, uh, the guy who arrested me, who the guy who's talking right now, he then goes, oh, my pockets are feeling a little light. For a certain amount of money, I might let you go. And then I go, how much? And then he goes, oh, you know, uh, name a price. And then I say 2000 And then he goes, oh, there's one count of bribery. And then Tony Andrews tells him not to charge me with it, and this guy charges it with me anyway. Then another, sir, and then, sir, hold on, sir, hold on, sir. First of all, that sounds like entrapment to me. That's sir. what I. That's what I said. I told him you're literally entrapping me. 
Number two, sir. You said Officer Andrews was there, present at the scene, sir? Not when the bribery happened after, when he came down because I called for his superior, and then Tony Andrews told him not to charge me with it, and then he charges me with it. Then and this is the same Officer Andrews who supplied you with the cocaine, He didn't correct, supply sir? me with the cocaine. No, he didn't supply it with me, but he, yes, he hired me as a CI. Then after that, when Tony Andrews came down there, he came down with a Sheriff Cornwood, and sh I told Sheriff Cornwood I fucked his wife, and then he took a gun out and, and, and held it on my head and, and uh, held me up. And sir, did you have sexual relations with that woman? Oh, 100%. I banged with. that bitch out left and right. You know the fucking streets hold me down. I fucked him and his sister. His sister is his wife that divorced him. Sir, hopefully that does not come into uh, evidence. Sir. Shit, I'm like saying, I, you, know, I, you know, I banged that bitch crazy. Behavior, you know sir. what I'm fucking saying? I mean, you know me. You know what I mean? I was the reason for the divorce. What's wrong with having two? You know what I mean? Ain't nothing no, wrong sir, with I it. I do not know you, sir. I'm just meeting you for the first time. Hey, That's my I'm fucking taking man. You know what I'm saying, No, right? sir. Hey, you know the fucking vibes. You know, we out here. You know I'm out here slaying. All right? Now here's yes, sir. So yes, then sir. Anyway, I appreciate your slaying, sir. So they're charging me with fucking bribery, which is complete bullshit. I didn't even do anything. And the, and the reason why I, re I wasn't even resisting arrest. I was just running away because I didn't want to interfere with them trying to catch the guy who had the fucking warrant out. And then they tased me, ran me over, mind you. And then uh, um, I'm charged with a possession of cocaine when I'm using it to arrest somebody because as I, I was uh, as I was hired as a CI by their leader, Trooper Andrews. Yes, sir. And, and, and they denied me, me a sir. lawyer. They denied me a lawyer. They and they refused and they didn't read my light my rights as well. Well, sir, I am here now. So as your attorney, so let me ask you this, sir: Do you know the length of sentence with which you are? Uh, uh, yeah, it's like twenty five months facing, in jail. Sir. For fucking something that didn't even the bribery charge should even be there. And he any fines, me. sir. I don't know what the fines are. Okay, so one second, sir. One second, sir. Hey, hey, real quick, real quick, come here. Hey, by the way, Ripley got kidnapped and shit, and he got his he he's on medication. So he might, you know. Just want to let you know that as well. He might not be. Are you telling me the officer was kidnapped, sir? Yeah, he was kidnapped and fucked up. And who was he kidnapped by? I have sir? no idea. I have no idea. That is a concern they as told well, me, they sir, told but I will me, handle it as your attorney, he, told, he tells me that he drinks on duty. He says two, what was it? I forgot. Two Johnny, Walker, two, two Johnny Walkers is his medication, he said. He said that in front of all the officers as well that are testifying. So he's drinking, Why, yes, sir, he's drinking good, on good, duty. Yes, sir. That is yep. good to know, yep. sir. Exactly, exactly. Yep. Okay, one second, sir. Yep, exactly. Excuse me, Your Honor. Yeah. I would like to know, is there any evidence that I need to review before this trial, sir? Just a gun and a baggie of cocaine. Why, thank you, sir. There are no documents which I need to review, sir. No. Why, thank you, sir. Yes. Okay, Mr. Rahman, sir, is there anything else I should know before we get started on this trial? Nothing sir? at all, sir. Nothing at all. Let's get fucking started. Oh, the gun okay, is mine. Okay, do you and see Mr. Yeah. And or do you see Officer Andrews anywhere, sir? No, he's not here. Okay, who is uh the officer eye Andrews, Mr. And Ripley, sir? Yes. And the other officer is who, sir? Oh, yelling, Rami. Uh, something. His name is Bison. And what is his role in this matter? He was his, he was his partner on the, in the car. Ripley's matter. Yeah, the gun the gun is legal and all that, by the way. Well, I'm sorry. So you were in possession of a gun as well? Yeah, sir? but I don't. I had a weapons license. It's fine. Okay, so I don't yeah. believe they have charge. I don't no, have no. any oh, charges. Okay, okay, right okay. There. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. So I do believe we are ready for trial. If we can get Let's Officer get Andrews here, going. so I'm going to ask if we can get Officer Andrews here. And Cornwood. And Cornwood. Ask about how they held me up in my cells. You know what I'm saying? They held me yes, at gunpoint with my. Yes, sir. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. I want. Like, Excuse me, off. Uh, Your Honor, sir. Yeah. Uh, before we get started, the defense would like to ask for two witnesses in this case, Your Honor. What witnesses are they? That would be Officer Andrews and Officer Cornwood, sir. Okay, uh, Mr. Ripley, can you reach out to those individuals? Uh, yeah. Why, thank you, sir. Thank you. Yes, Your Honor. Dispatch 416.
I'm gonna fucking completely fuck up these guys. They're gonna do this to me? Okay. Say less. I ain't going to jail. Fuck these guys. Let's get fucking going. And let's get this shit started. We got this, BJP. We got this. Yes, sir. You know, I will represent you to the fullest of my ability, sir. Of course, of course. <sighs> this is disgusting behavior. As you are aware, sir, the courtrooms of Los Santos are not always friendly to the defendant. Who's, am I the defendant? Yes, you are the defendant, sir. Yeah, fuck that. Sir, do you know the identity of the gentleman behind you, sir? Yeah, you know, these are my gangsters, my killers in the streets. You know what I'm saying? This is my hood uh, yes, sir, let's not, let's not reference your friends as killers, sir. I do not believe <laughs> that would advance your cause, sir. What you mean? Let's call them your colleagues, sir. My colleagues? No. Nah, nah, nah. These are my real killers chilling in the cut. You know what I'm saying? Man, I didn't go to college. Yelling. Yes, sir, 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 sir. Let's let's again. Oh, yeah. I, I, I yes, sir, highly yes, advise honor. that you do not reference them as your <laughs> killers you your sir, about for the, the purpose of this care. trial, sir. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know I'm gangster. Sorry. And, yes, and what are their names, sir? Shit, my motherfucker in the Boss middle. City. His name is Marlo. Rami, you're still yelling. Yes, sir. My fucking in the middle these, named Marlo. Uh, should we wait for the witnesses or the man to okay his left? Start maybe like opening Pablo, statements or something. A hood ass motherfucker. Uh, well, the the defense motion for that, so I'll leave it up to them. All right, defense. Would you mind if yeah, we, we uh, start? Okay, we can have them join in, and if well, there's anything, to my I don't mind lawyer. waiting. to my lawyer. But I want to make Absolutely. this perfectly clear: if they're requesting the witness, and those witnesses don't show up, I'm not going to feel comfortable doing this trial in a bench fashion without those witnesses here. And okay. I will refer to it to the DA and put it on the docket. I could not have said okay. it better myself, Yana. And I do believe, since the witnesses are in the control of the state, Yana, I would like to wait for them to be present for this trial, sir. Very well. All right, you called them to come down here, right? What they say? Up, Bison? Fucked up. Okay. What the fuck? What did you say to Rami? What? what did you I say know. To I know how these cops are. Right? You just keep objecting them, and they'll fucking they'll break. They're gonna break, Rami. Yeah. I do believe we have we have caught a break with a good judge. You've sir. got a good judge and shit cops. Yes, the best judge, correct? You've got a great a great judge and dog shit cops, which should be good. <laughs> Your Honor, you're looking, you're looking good today. You lose weight? Gotta suck his dick a little bit, you know? You gotta suck his dick a little bit. Shut up, Rami. Your Honor, you're looking really good. Oh, yes, sir. Sweet him up a little bit, uh, BJP. Sweet him up a little bit. Sir, I will sweet him up with my legal expertise, sir. Yes, sir. Not yes, with sir. any promises of oil fixation, yes, sir. sir. Of course, of course, of course. Judge, looking a little tight down there. You've uh, been working out? What's going on? Rami, I am appalled that you would sexualize this honorable judge. <laughs> See that? Shut the fuck up, Ripley. That's what that means. You shut the fuck up, Rami. Is that his name? While we're waiting, I'm gonna go by the vending machine. All right. You said your name is BJ? I love BJ's. Hey BJ, have you had a chance to see the evidence yet? Hey, how about you shut the fuck up, stop talking to my lawyer? I'm trying to extend a professional courtesy to make yeah, sure yeah, he has yeah, access to review dick. the evidence, okay? You know what's unprofessional? Your eye patch, please. Okay, listen, you're, yeah, sir, do you need the evidence out. or do you have Obviously, already? yes, I have not had a chance to review any evidence yet, sir. Okay, um. Yeah, crip, Cripply. Can... Yeah, Cripply, oh. chill the fuck out. Yeah. Shut, shut up, doorman. Yeah, you in another chair with wheels, that's familiar territory, huh? 
<laughs> Officer, I apologize for the uh, <laughs> comments there, so I hope that you and I can see eye to eye on this matter. The f Is that a fucking eye joke? Hey, Ripley, take no, your seat. No, sir, I would never, you, sir. Ripley, take your seat in the chair. Uh, You're used to eyes. being in wheelchairs. Probably feel more comfortable. A little bit more comfortable for you, you know? Go ahead, take your seat, boss. Son of a bitch. Remember, you running over my foot there, Ripley. I did run over his foot. I felt it. I still remember it. Is Tony, trying to make you tougher. I'm trying to make you tougher. Anytime soon? I, I remember that. All right. Forever. Ripley, are they, are they coming down here? Or what's going on? What road you they are at? bison stalking them right now. All right, maybe I can share this with you. Yes, sir. Unfortunately, I do not have my phone with me, though, sir, as it was taken up oh, um, by the metal detector, sir. Okay, that makes it tricky. So uh, let me try and email you, I guess, somehow. Sir, that is acceptable. That would be acceptable, sir. All right. Yeah, we're just trying to see eye to eye here, Ripley. <laughs> you know? Yeah. <clears throat> I just want to let you guys know. I'm not a okay. CI, all right? I mean, isn't that exactly what a CI would say, though? True, true. But I had my excuse to get the fuck out of this, right? So just, uh... Right? Oh. <laughs> oh, fuck. They're fucking on to me. If they find out I'm a CI, I'm gonna fucking die. Oh, fuck. They're gonna kill me. No. Uh. These guys are just Vamos. dumb. Yeah, what's going on? You got this, buddy. Don't you worry. Of course. Of course. All right. I can't really, like, email you, I, mean, I guess. You so I'm just going to, like, you, uh, fucking just give you the evidence so you can recently? just take a look at huh? it and give it back, okay? Ripley over there. He like yes, he sir. That will be acceptable, sir. <sighs> okay, can we start this? Figure out what lock right for me. Look like he lost about six and a half hours. Your Honor, uh, Andrews and the other uh, coin went on their way. Uh, they should have been on their way 20 minutes ago. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. All right, here you go. Check your pocket. Yeah, it looks like he just lost 7.5 grams. <laughs> sir, I see the cocaine, sir. Did you say there was a gun as well, sir? <laughs> yes. Um, <laughs> fucking Milo. I guess you could just take my word for it. There's a gun. Fuck I'm Pablo, not, I mean, what the fuck was that? He's not being charged for the gun. <laughs> he's going to get it back, but I just want to let you what? know. I did, I did what, seize Robert? his gun. I have it in my pocket right now. <laughs> Do it again, but yell it. Why, yes, sir, but there's no charge on the gun, sir. <laughs> Correct. That's what I said. There's no charge on the gun. I see. Okay, so the because... only charge, the only official charges in, sir, are the resisting arrest. Yes. The possession of this cocaine. Yes. And bribery. Is that correct, sir? Yes. And can you tell me the length of the sentence my child, my client is facing, sir? Yes. Uh, if found guilty on all charges, your, your client will face 24 months in Bolingbrook Maximum Security Penitentiary with an additional 48 <laughs> months of parole to be served the whole time, bro, and a fine of $1,800. <laughs> Free my man's right now. This is ridiculous. Yeah, this is literally fucking dumb shit. Like you, you, you hear this shit. And right? I, I'm sorry, sir. I could not tell if you were talking to me, sir. Me? Yeah. Did you hear what I said, or? Oh, I, I heard no, sorry. you. Sorry, I could not tell if you were talking to me, so I thought yeah. you might be looking somewhere else. Sir. Yeah, sorry yeah, about that, boss. We couldn't. Here. Yeah, be twenty-four months. We couldn't tell your eye patch. You know what I mean, Ripley? And one thousand eight hundred dollars. Yeah. Why? Well, thank you, sir. Uh huh. Ripley, I don't think you understood the joke. We couldn't tell because your eye patch. You know. Sorry, take okay. a seat in your wheelchair. Um, Excuse me, Mr. Raman, sir. Yeah, what's going on? I highly suggest that you and this officer patch up your difficulties right now, sir. Oh, you mean the same way he patched up his eye? Yeah, yeah, I got you. <laughs> you, get it. Yeah, you got that one, Marlo? <laughs> that hey, thanks, one. thanks for the alley oop on that one, BJ. That was a good one. <laughs> Apparently, 
apparently Rami thinks it's very funny to uh, to work, okay? Some of us have to work for a living, unlike uh, this he's artist guy over here. <laughs> you know what doesn't work, though? Your eye. Business. He just told me, he, wait, he's a business Dang. owner? He just told me he doesn't own That's any so business. That's so funny! That's so funny! He's not a business owner? Are you sure? You just said he was a business owner. Okay. Okay, well, am I a fucking... Bid oh, shit, sorry. Well, he just told me he here. was not uh, a business uh, owner, so... Yeah, because he don't own it, but he... Yeah, like... he didn't mean business, he meant bidness. Oh. <laughs> Cops are good at uh, charging people for hearsay, so we might as Bro. well use that too then. Is Tony Andrews walking here, or what's going on? Well, you can start this. I, they'll show up in time, I think. Two fifteen from two hundred two. Is that coming today? Why is this guy taking fucking twenty fucking minutes to get here? I don't understand. Andrews, are you on radio? For you, Sergeant. What's that? You want to go try to find him and deliver this message? Yeah, can personally? you fucking get him over here? Yeah, he needs uh, to get here. We, we're all like half to hour, bro. Trial again. Andrews needs to be here, and Cornwood has to be here. Okay, I'll tell him you want him there. Mr. Bassa, okay, what's right. the update? Uh, Sergeant Ripley, just try to get a hold of him again, and he said, "And I quote, I'm on my way." They got five minutes to get here. If they're not here within five minutes, uh, you can send this to the DA and y'all can put this on the docket. Pursue charges mm, okay. another time. Svenson just uh, left. He's my runner. He's going to go get him and bring him back here. Your Honor. Your Honor, in the interest of justice, the defense is ready to proceed as soon as the witnesses arrive, Your Honor. Very well, uh, but I will swear them in as soon as they get here. That way I can get everyone together to save time. I have no objection to that, Yana. That's fine with me. Control, thanks for that. Five months. Oh, man. Good news. <sighs> Through my expertise and expert police work, I have ascertained he's out front walking in. You're welcome. Well, thank you, officer. Got yeah, Maddie Ice, thanks for that brand new prime as well. And Ox Dub, thanks for that brand new prime. And... At least one of them know how to do their job. Remind me to never call for a bench trial again. This is ridiculous. And get my job. I don't think you understood the joke. We couldn't tell because your eye patch, you know? Uh -huh. <laughs> Sorry, okay. take a seat in your wheelchair. Excuse um. me, Mr. Raman, sir. <laughs> I highly suggest comes, that gentlemen. you and this officer patch up your difficulties right now, sir. Oh, you mean the same way he patched up his eye? Yeah, you, yeah, you, <laughs> yeah, you got that one, Marlo? <laughs> no, hey, thanks, thanks for the alley oop on that one, BJ. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here's one of them. I apologize, Your Honor. Good day, officer. Good day. Until you do it back. Oh, okay. Appreciate it, uh, Mr. Andrews, Mr. Cornwood, can you step forward? Uh, Mr. Cornwood is currently uh, uh, yelling, speaking about some I stuff. I can't hear you when you're that far away. Sorry, Your Honor. I said Mr. Cornwood is uh, currently in deep thought right now. You might have to give him a little bit. Okay, can you put your hand up in here? Sure. You swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, and appeals to put yourself in coil? Of course. All right, I just want to get that out of the way before I forgot. You can go back to him. Okay. Okay, is defense ready to proceed now? Are they happy? Yes, sir. Defense is prepared and ready, sir. All right, Mr. Ooh. Ripley, start from the beginning. Yes, Your Honor. Uh, at this point, uh, approximately 
I don't know, 30 minutes ago, maybe 40 minutes ago. Uh, there was a flick of bank robbery uh, at the Vespucci, uh, the Vespucci Boulevard flick of bank branch at Legion Square. Uh, we attempted to find those bank robbers. Uh, they crashed at the Vespucci Canals area, and one of them was arrested and taken into custody, has pled guilty to his charges, and is currently serving time at Bowling Brook Penitentiary. His name is Uchiha Jones. Uh, while relevance? securing that scene... Objection, and... Yana! Relevance! Rebuttal. Uh, I'm, I'm, it will be part of my testimony that to do uh, with the bank. this gentleman is involved with that crime and is what? is a known associate of the uh, of the. What, where is he? Like, it, what is he doing? Okay, oh so God. while we were securing that scene uh, and getting medical attention for Mr. Jones, who had been tased, uh, the the accused here slow rolled by because a crime I know the scene guy, with he's uh, gonna say, Mr. Kevin in a like, what uh, the fuck gray is that? Uh, car. Uh, when I drove alongside them and told them to leave the area, they had no masks on and agreed that they would leave the area. Um, but having spoken with them um, and He's identified their faces, I realized that uh, Mr. Kebun did have a felony warrant for his arrest. So I initiated a traffic stop on the vehicle. Uh, That's not even the what suspects happened. both ran uh, or tried to drive away. After a what? long, dangerous high-speed chase, they eventually crashed their car, uh, got out on the Del Perro Freeway and started running on foot. Um, I was able to catch up with Mr. al Rahman after shouting and telling him to surrender several times. Eventually, they had to deploy my taser on him and get him into custody. That's not even what happened. Uh, as I was trying to get him into handcuffs, a unidentified car rolled up alongside him and tried to, to get him to scoop him up. But uh, I was able to get him in cuffs and pull him away to the sidewalk, and uh, that car drove off, sparking another chase, which is unrelated to this one at this point. So, once in my custody, uh, we got him medical for the taser prongs, booked him down at Mission Row PD, incident to arrest, a search was conducted, a, a baggie of cocaine was seized during that arrest, which has been submitted into evidence. Uh, and uh, his legal firearm was also seized, uh, even though, you know, it's perfectly legal. He is licensed, but uh, it's not legal to have that in the cell. So I've got that in my custody. Uh, during the booking process, uh, he made mention several times of what a small and petty charge uh, possession of cocaine is. I told him that I disagreed and that it is a, uh, a crime and that I plan to enforce uh, the crime and... Uh, apply the law as I, you know, as I deem it's necessary. Uh, he deemed, uh, he repeated that it's a small crime and it's not really necessary to do jail time for it or anything. And, uh, Wait, what does that implied do with that he's got money. Uh, I asked him to make an offer in terms of what he's trying to say. Uh, he offered that if I were to accept $2,000 from him, that I could simply make the charge disappear and forget it. It's not your birthday. Don't talk to me. <laughs> At that point, uh, I charged him with bribery, and uh, as well as the resisting of my attempt to arrest him and the possession of the uh, <laughs> cocaine. Uh, he said, uh, after being Mirandized, that he did not know the suspect that we had in our custody, Yushiha Jones. Uh, Officer Bison here to my right uh, confirmed through. Uh, How do who uh, hired Uchiha? Didn't, didn't I get rid indeed, of him? Yushiha Jones is a coworker of his. Bobby, at, Bobby uh, hiring the, like everybody, bro. Like, or something or other gar art gallery he works at. I forget the name. It's fancy. I don't know French why Bobby name. hired him. And uh, he lied up and down after being Mirandized to my face that uh, he did not know no, the guy. Chat, he knew him. He, I, Once I, again, I, Your Honor, I must object. Chat, to the I didn't hire him. Your I fired him when he worked at the Rooster's Nest. Has to do with any of these charges, Your Honor. I agree. Your Honor, he was lying to me left, right, and center throughout the booking process. I didn't lie to anybody. You're what not. does that Mr. Ripley have to do with any of the charges he's After I told today? him that I was charging him with bribery, he indicated that I was lying and that he's telling the truth. Your own so I'm really trying to explain that he was lying the whole time. Don't talk. That is, uh, that is all I have to say, Your Honor. Okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to uh, sustain that objection and strike that last part from the record. Thank okay. you, Your Honor. Which part, just so I'm clear, which part is being struck specifically? The part about UTO Jones. The part about, okay, so the part where he works with UTS struck. Fair enough. Okay, I don't. I don't need that. That's fine. Yeah, that's why it's stricken. Okay, um, I got a question for you, Mr. Ripley. Um, what you, you said that you 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 were on a foot chase with Mr. Rami? Yeah, that's right. What was he wanted for? Uh, he was in a car with a man with a felony warrant. There was a reckless evading chase that occurred when the car crashed. The suspects all got out and then ran toward another towards another car. That ended up escaping with Mr. Kevin. I ran away because I didn't I want to interfere. arrested him before he was able to get into that car. With Yana, the, the person I was looking for. Your Honor, excuse me, Your Honor. While I appreciate your line of question, Your Honor, I be, do believe you would allow me to question him first, Your Honor. There will be no need for any further questions. No, in a bench trial, the way I run my courtroom in a bench trial, I ask questions, and I also allow you to ask questions. 
Why, yes, Yana, I apologize, Yana. So, Mr. Ripley, once again, uh, that didn't really uh, answer my question. You gave me okay. a, a scenario around it, but I'll ask you again. What was Mr. Rami wanted for arrest for? Uh, Mr. Rami was wanted because I was trying to detain uh, that car because it was containing a felon. And uh, the vehicle did not stop. And when it did come to a stop after a crash, all the occupants got out and ran from me towards another car. So he was wanted for what? fleeing by detainment of that car, Your Honor. It's not even what happened. Is that acceptable? I'm just asking questions. Okay, I'm sorry okay. to be. What was uh, was Mr. Rami the, the the driver? I am not, unable to identify oh, him as the driver. The now. So this guy is lying. I don't think okay. he was driving. I was not driving. So. Oh my God! I'm gonna ask you again. What crime was Mr. Rummy wanted for? Uh, yeah, there we go, Judge. Make him look dumb. The crime of yeah, he, uh, he was detained and then he fled. Make so him look dumb. Make him look dumb. Arrest. Yeah. Or resisting detainment, or whatever, you, whatever you'd want to call that, if he willingly left my detainment. He was wanted for resisting arrest. I was chasing him because he was in the car with a wanted felon. He then left the car and ran to another car. I I, he was detained at that point. He was running towards a car, and I tased him and arrested him, Your Honor, for attempting to flee from my detainment. I'll let my the attempted detain him. I'm sorry, Your Honor. I did not hear you. Is it time for my cross-examination? It is. Why, thank you, Your Honor. Officer Ripley... In your, excuse me, I just want to reiterate for the, for the purpose of making sure your testimony is correct. It's your testimony that my client was not the driver of this car. Is that a, you're asking me if my testimony, yeah, I did, I did indeed testify that your, your client was not the driver of the car, yes. Okay, woo! And is it your understanding of the law in Los Santos... That resisting arrest is a crime, correct? Uh, yeah. Um, yeah. That's right. However, mm -hmm. my client was not under arrest. He was <laughs> only resisting detainment. Talk your shit, is that BJ. your testimony, sir? Sure, yeah. He resisted detainment, yeah. And therefore, if he had not been arrested for this resisting detainment, there would have been no charge of possession of this alleged cocaine and no charge of this bribery. Would you agree with that, Officer Ripley? Uh, yeah, I would agree with that. Yeah, he ran from my attempt to detain him. That's why he was arrested and then incident to arrest, he was searched, which resulted in the... Yeah, that's... Yes, we're in agreement. What's, what's your point? Uh, sir, excuse me. So this is my cross-examination, <laughs> sir. I will determine what point... Talk your shit. Talk your shit, BJ. Yeah, if he just stood there with his hands up, I would have not arrested him. Yes, I agree. Further, further, would you agree that my client had not committed a crime at the time other than just riding in a car? And you would agree that riding in a car with a known felon is not a crime. Yeah, it's not a crime. That's why he probably should have just surrendered instead of trying to run. Yeah. Yep. Scared for my life. Further, let's move along to the, uh, let's take these charges in order. Let's move along to the possession of cocaine. We will get to that when Officer Andrews reaches, reaches the stand. But right now I'd like to discuss the bribery charge. Can you please... Repeat the circumstances under which the bribery subject came up, Officer Ripley. Can I, you want me to repeat my testimony again? Yes, please. Uh, okay. Yeah, if I have to repeat myself, uh, we were bringing him into booking for processing. <laughs> uh, he was talking about uh, how petty the crime was and low the time and fine was and how he's got a lot of money. It's not worth it. Uh, I told him I plan on, uh, applying the law as it's written. Uh... I was asking him what, what he's trying to get at, if he's trying to make an offer or something. He said uh, he'd pay me $2,000 if I forgot the charge. And uh, that's illegal. That's, for, that's attempting to bribe me for money. So therefore, it is your testament that you asked him to name a price in which he could allegedly bribe you. Is that correct, officer? Your Honor, asked and answered. Why, why do I have to keep repeating myself? Is this part of, like, do I have to say I'm this? Your Honor, I'm I'm attempting to lay the foundation for entrapment, Your Honor. I believe that foundation's already been laid. Okay. Uh, Why, thank you, I'm Your gonna, Honor. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sustain that objection. 
And the reason why I haven't interrupted it, Mr. Ripley, is because it hasn't been objected. You fucked, Ripley. Okay. Fuck you, Your Honor. Honor, am I allowed to? Am I allowed to object? By any sure. Chance? Oh, okay. of course. The guy who's a judge character on his other character. Oh, At here this we point, go. I have no further questions. Here we go. Ripley, of course, Honor. dude. Okay, here we go. Am I allowed to ask some questions? Go for it. Uh, Officer Ripley, how long have you been a cop for? Uh, like three decades. Okay. Uh, if somebody runs from uh, attempting to be detained or being detained, what is that considered? Resisting arrest. Okay, Wait, do you charge for resisting arrest? Yeah, there's a charge for it. It's a misdemeanor. Five Your months. Honor, what happens when you arrest Ron, somebody? You're is he allowed to even do that? He, this is, he's asking this... me questions, Rami. Shut the fuck up! Isn't this, like, conflict of interest if he's the, his partner in crime on this? Your Honor, I want Rami contempted. No, I don't care what you want, Ripley. Don't ever order me around. Look, yeah. it's not because they don't have a district attorney, so they don't have any choice but to do this. I, I get that it seems weird, but unfortunately, we don't have a district attorney on call for every single bench trial. So sometimes we have to make do it what we got. So that's why we make this the exception and allow it. All right. Let's continue. Where would you like me to go back to, Your Honor? The last question. I uh, believed I asked what happens after you get arrested. Uh, your search incident to arrest. Okay. Uh, now, when we were in the cells and you were talking to Mr. Al-Rahman, did he mention uh, dropping the charge before you mentioned uh, naming a price? Yeah, he kept asking over and over to drop the charge. Okay, did he, uh, did he say that he'd make any uh, kind of, um, like, what can we do to drop the charge or anything like that? Yeah, he kept implying he had some kind of offer. What the fuck? Is that when you asked, uh, name your can price? We object, can we object this? Isn't this yeah, like, I asked act, him what like... he's getting at. What's his, is he trying to make an offer? Okay, so the uh, insinuation or beginning well, of a bribe started ever... before you asked for the uh, amount. That's correct. I was trying to get to the bottom of what he was trying to say. Okay, no further questions. I wasn't even Mirandized. Anything from the defense? Your Honor, I just want to say that I wasn't even Mirandized. We heard you. Mr. Rami, give me one second, please, sir. Sorry about that, sir. Sorry. Yes. Mr. Ripley, can you tell me at which time you read my client his Miranda rights, sir? Uh, at no point did I specifically read him his Miranda rights, sir. No further questions, y'all. <laughs> Your Honor, I would like to counter that. What question. is good, boys? You don't get to. Okay, Bison. Wait, do no. I get to count? Oh, okay. He just made it sound really stupid. Okay, Bison Mirandized him. Okay. No, so I believe didn't. you did that all no, yourself. So. Let, me, let me let me let me stop you right there. All right. right. Let me tell you how good. I don't get this. Okay. He he. After he's done, it's over. It's it. <laughs> yeah. Done. Okay. You fucked Ripley. Okay. <laughs> Fuck you, Robbie. Now, uh. I don't, I don't have anything else for you, uh, Mr. Ripley. Mr. Bison? Yes, sir. You want to give me your side of the story? Do you want me to get sworn in first, sir? I swore everyone in. You wasn't there? No, I was not there when you, when you, you started You swore to tell in. the truth, the whole truth, the lead with the truth, and a penalty of perjury, so help you, Coil. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, essentially, uh, the entire first half of the story is the same what Ripley said. We were waiting by, uh, next to somebody that we had apprehended uh, after a chase for a bank robbery. Two individuals and a black and colored sultan drove by. Myself and Ripley gave chase, and then we had to break off for gas while other units started chasing. We came back. The vehicle took a jump uh, onto Del Perro Freeway. They, uh, we thought they kept going, but then it turns out they disabled their vehicle. Both the individuals got out, started running uh, southbound across the lanes of travel on the Del Perro Freeway. Uh, I was driving the vehicle that caught eyes on them first. So I drove up next to them and said, stop running, stop running. They continued to he run. Didn't say that. Uh, the driver, uh, we lost eyes on the driver, so we stayed on Mr. Al Rahman, who is the other individual in the car. So we continued to chase him, and then we eventually apprehended him <clears> after <throat> the driver came back with another vehicle and tried to catch. So why is he chasing the guy who's want who's not wanted? But he's, they let the guy who is wanted. Free. Uh, were you there for the the whole bribery thing? Yes. Yeah, I can go into that as well. Um, uh, I just have a question for you. About yeah, it. go for it. Uh, the the bribery incident. Where did it occur at? Uh, the it was in bribery the incident, Yana. I think we both know that. It was uh, it was in the cells of MRPD. Okay. Uh, is it okay if I keep going? Cause I, I forgot I had to go into that part too. Or do you want sure. me to stop? If you want to keep going, you can. Yeah. So we got into the uh the cells, and I will admit that uh, Rami was not Mirandized at this point. But at this point, uh, Rami had said just a bunch, just out of excited utterances. We didn't have to Mirandize him at that point because we weren't questioning him about any crimes that were related. Uh, to the reason he was being arrested, uh, at which point, at which point, after we started talking about charges, I then Mirandized him myself, and then we went forward from there. Um, during the time uh, before he was Mirandized, Rami uh, did indeed say something along the lines of, not verbatim, 
was something along the lines of, uh, what can we do to get these charges dropped? Just drop the charge. It's just cocaine. It's not that big of a deal. It's one bag. Yada, 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 yada. I must object to any entry of any statements that were made before my client was read his Miranda rights, Your Honor. May I rebut, Your Honor? Mm -hmm. Miranda rights don't have to come and play until we start questioning. Your client was making excited utterances, which, as a lawyer, you would know that's an exception to the Miranda rights. Rebuttal? Jan, I would disagree that these were excited under utterances by my client. It's already been stated that uh, Officer Ripley was included in this conversation, Yana. This was a back and forth. These were not just excited utterances all on the part of my client, Yana. Sustained. No questions were asked thank pertaining you, to any crimes, Your Honor. Uh, thank you, Your Honor. Thank you. <laughs> uh, I get that. But a spontaneous <laughs> utterance something that happens in a <laughs> moment. It's so, the MRPD station... Uh, and use nothing around you but other officers. At that point, that's what uh, Miranda's for. This one's going to be easy. Uh, I'll take a seat. Against you, and that protects you from saying something to incriminate yourself. Yeah. That's the whole reason the case law was Wow, this lawyer for. really is good. Yeah, Sustained. fuck Ripley. I'm happy we fucking kidnapped him and, killed, and uh, took his eye out. Fuck uh, okay. the defense Shout out to all my boys. For, uh, no, Your Honor, no further questions. Very well. Uh, Mr. Andrews. <clears throat> yes, sir. Can you, can you come up here and come forward? Right away, sir. So, Mr. Andrews is your witness for the defense, you, so... Where, where do you want me to go, sir? I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, you're fine. You come up to the podium. That's fine. Um, are you just want to ask any questions, or you want a statement from him, since he's your witness? So, I would like to ask him some questions, but if he is prepared to give a statement prior to my questions, Yana, you, you I'm, I'm fine with that as well. With all due respect, sir, I wasn't here for the incident. I was just there when the charges were being discussed. So I'm okay, not... I want to make it perfectly clear that Mr. Andrews is the defense's witness. Well, I thank you, Yana. Then I am prepared to question him, Yana. Go ahead. Sure. Officer Andrews. Yes, sir. When did you first meet my client, Mr. Rami, sir? Uh -huh. It was uh, December 2nd, 1999, <laughs> I believe. <clears throat> so you've known him for quite some time then, officer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, and uh, Yon, I just wanted to make sure that Officer Andrews was sworn in before I start this questioning. He was. Yes, sir. Officer Andrews, has my client, Mr. Rami, ever served as a confidential informant for you, Mr. Oh, Andrews? Officer Andrews? Yes, sir, he has. And did any of that confidential informant work by my client involve the selling or supply of cocaine? I'm, I'm sorry, ask the question again. Did any of my client's confidential informant work involve the supply <laughs> or selling of cocaine? He just notified me when he was in cells that that's what he was using the cocaine that was on his persons for. And is that a logical conclusion from his confidential informant work, Officer Andrews? It could be, yes. Well, I thank you, Officer. No further questions, Your Honor. Defense, you have any or uh, prosecution, you have any questions for Mr. Andrews? Um, yeah, sure. I'll ask uh, Andrews. <clears throat> yes, sir. Uh, if you have a CI... Can I turn around? Yeah, you can... If you've got a CI, let's say, for example, for, from a police perspective, does that give them carte blanche to break the law? Chat, Generally, him saying I'm a CI is all minor, a cover up. The fact that I'm paying off Tony their, Andrews. Uh, I'm not actually a CI. These percentage. guys know that I'm paying off Tony Andrews. What if they're just, Everybody uh, in this courtroom knows that I pay off Tony Andrews other than those two cops right there and then? those two cops. Arrest them. Are they so him to saying, the law? I have to say that to him because CI? him saying and him no. even calling me my CI. Do they have any rights or uh, or privileges that are not afforded to common citizens? No. Thank you. Permission for a brief redirect, Yana. Go for it, Officer Andrews. Would you consider the selling of cocaine? I've literally or I, I already the cocaine told from a and all larger like, dealer just to be an instance of. Reeling in a big fish, as you earlier stated. Well, answer your first question. I feel like selling the cocaine to somebody else would be a larger crime than what he would be bringing in. And, and I'm sorry, I misspoke, Officer Andrews. Procuring cocaine from a larger distributor. Well, just based on my 
training and experience, I, I'm not too sure what he would be able to bring in as a big fish with one bag of cocaine. If he had procured that cocaine from a distributor, would that be a way of, of potentially helping to bring in a larger fish, to use your words? I, I, I don't know how he would. Why, thank you, officer. No further questions, Yana. Mr. Andrew, you can go back to where you were at. Yes, thank sir. Thank you are. for coming down here. No problem, sir. Mr. Cornwood. Mr. Cornwood, he's calling you. Yep. Step <laughs> oh, fuck. This guy's a fucking snitch. Absolutely. Did you raise your hand in the air? Yep. You swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, the nothing but the Mr. truth. Mr. Rami, sir, what does Mr. Cornwood know, sir? Coil. Oh, no, he just put a gun to my head and. Uh, I do. Okay. Uh, for the defense, this is your witness. Do you wish him to give a statement or you just want to ask him a few questions? Uh, statements. A statement, please, Your Honor, would be fine. Chat, you guys are actually fucking okay. annoying. What happened from your side of the story? Uh, for what? The incident in question. What is the incident in question? Just ask some questions. Stop being Pepega, chat. My ass took so good. Mr. Cornwood, sir. Oh, yeah, baby. Yep. Are you familiar with my client, Mr. Rami, sir? That I am. And did you have an uh, an interaction with him today, sir, in the cells of Mission Road Police Department, sir? Objection. Is the objection? Yeah, I asked and answered. Never mind. Excuse I did me, not sir? answer yet. Oh, okay. You didn't answer? Okay. Objection. Relevance. Rebuttal. Sir, this is the beginning of my question. I'm out. Please lay this foundation before Mr. Ripley interrupts me any further. <laughs> Well, you did the same thing to Ripley, and I allowed him to lay his foundation, so I guess it wouldn't be fair if I didn't allow you. So well, I'll thank you, Honor. Officer Cornwood. Yep. Did you have any interaction with my client in the cells at Mission Row Police Department today? That I did. And could you describe that interaction for the court, please? Uh, I was sitting there. I was keeping him busy. You know, his mouth kept moving. I was trying to tire out his mouth. So uh, I was talking to him a little bit uh, while uh, the other officers were going through and having talking a discussion about his, about his issues. And then uh, then he insulted my ex-wife and up said Bring that up he Shelley. had been having uh, sex with her, sexual relations with my ex-wife since yes, 1973. Yep. Which he still claims that he had been doing. That damn bitch, let me tell you, she took she took the kids. She took Jebediah, she took Josiah, <laughs> Zeke, Honor, and Timothy. Your Honor, I was fucking his wife, and he got upset and Excuse pulled the gun Mr. out. Excuse me, Mr. Rami, sir. Mr. Yes, Rami, sir, let me handle this, sir. Yes, so, sir. Hey, fuck that bitch's pussy. Yeah, I did. Anyway, anyway, that's what I'm saying. One more out, Mr. Rami, I'm going to hold you in contempt. Yes, sir, my apologies. Sorry, Shelly, she was... <laughs> I'm sure if you saw her, too, Your Honor, you'd be amazed. You think I'm joking, hey, Rami, I'm not. Uh, <laughs> hey, hey, you shut your, you shut your dad dumb mouth when you're talking about Shelly. Okay. So anyway, this bitch, this scarlet whore, she <laughs> took my damn kids, took everything from me. And then he said that he had been having sexual intercourse with her since 1973, which, hell, I'm going to be honest, I didn't even know he was that old. So uh, I told him he, he's lucky if I wasn't in charge, otherwise he'd be 25 to life. And Officer Cornwood, sir. At any point during this interaction, sir, did you point your gun at my client, Objection, Mr. Rami, Objection, your honor. How is this relevant to the charges leveled against Mr. L. Robin? Your honor, if you will, if you will provide me a little bit of leeway, sir, I will get there, your honor. I promise, sir. I'm done sir. giving you leeway. No. What? Sustained. Fuck, man. Your honor, there's been a charge of bribery against my client, your honor, which I do believe we had already defeated. But if, if we have not, I need to establish my client's state of mind, your honor. Mr. Cornwood was not in the cells at the time. This, that the you don't get to give a, a, a sorry testimony there, Ripley. No, this is the sign of question, in my opinion, is going nowhere, and I'm done with it. Then no further questions, your honor. Prosecution. Um... Okay, uh, Mr. Cornwood. Yep. Uh, when you arrived in the cells at Mission Row PD, uh, do you know why? Why were you? Why were you coming to the cells at Mission Row PD at all? 
Uh, I was looking for Andrews since I was uh, doing some work with him. Okay, and it, did Andrews mention why we, why you were going down to the cells at Mission Row? Uh, no. Okay, fair enough. Um. All right. Um, this guy's okay. dumb. Just today, yeah, yeah, today, yeah. brother. You want to keep stuttering or what's going on, Ripley? Watch <laughs> <laughs> your eye, not your tongue. Yeah. All right. The bribery. Had, never mind. You're, you're good. To go. Yeah. I yeah. Questions. Hey, Corn. When I, I fuck Shelly tonight, I'm gonna tell her all about this one tonight, baby. Robbie. Mr. Rami, sir. Hey, what uh, the you fuck? Son of a bitch. That's you fucked keep, up. Your Honor, you I haven't even said anything. Your Honor. Your Honor, I haven't said anything. Shelly Cornwood is a saint. I'm fucking Shelly tonight, real fucking good. Shelly Cornwood is a bitch. Okay. But only I'm allowed to call her a bitch. Okay. Nobody else can call her a bitch. You can go back, Mr. Crowwood. Your Honor, I Thank haven't you, even Honor. been saying anything, Your Honor. I don't know what these guys are talking about. Okay, Mr. Rami. Uh, I'm gonna fuck her real good tonight, Cornwood. wish to waive his Fifth Amendment right and give a statement, or does he wish to remain silent? No, sir, Your Honor, Honor, the defense I'm, rests, I'm Your Honor. talking at a level where the judge can't hear me, but everybody else can. Your Honor, Very well. I'm going <laughs> to give both witness? sides a small brief chance to go over uh, you know, their, their whole situation and the pros and cons and the flaws and all that. Start with the prosecution. Go ahead. All right. Um, Your Honor, I believe that uh, the, the charges leveled against Mr. Araman are supported by the evidence and testimony. Uh, he did resist arrest because I was attempting to apprehend him. He was detained and uh, intentionally fled from there. I had to tase him to get him into my custody at that point. Um, the physical uh, nature of his resisting was, I believe, adequate for the charge of resisting arrest. Once uh, in and my custody, incident to arrest, uh, he night, did have cocaine in his possession, after. which is a misdemeanor. And I'm in the state of San Ripley. Andreas, uh, oh again, I believe that's enough to support oh, that. Tragic. Once in uh, in the cells, he did make an offer to uh, uh, give me $2,000 in cash in order to make Ugh. the cocaine charge go away. I believe that's, that's bribery. So, uh, as per my testimony <laughs> and the testimony of the other witnesses here, I believe all... All charges are supported, Your Honor. That's all I have to say. Okay, and the defense side. Thank you, Your Honor. I would like to start by saying none of the charges, Your Honor, are lawful in that they began in which my client was not committing any crime and there was no probable cause for his detainment other than riding in a car, Your Honor. I think that has been fairly established by the evidence today. Further, <clears throat> Excuse me, sir. This is my closing argument, sir. Don't bring up the CI shit. Don't bring up the CI shit. Your Honor, further, we discussed the bribery charge. My client had not been Miranda's at that time, and he was responding to questions from Officer Ripley. They were not excited utterances, Your Honor. That has been established as well. And then finally, the possession... The ass. Good job of that. The <laughs> possession of cocaine charge, Your Honor. We already uh, it also established that my client had a, a cure, procured that possession of cocaine as part of his job as a confidential informant for Officer Andrews, which he testified to. Y'all. So therefore, based on all these statements, y'all, I ask that all charges against my client be dismissed and he be set free. I can explain. I can explain. Thank you, Honor. This guy's a fucking I'm going to go in the back and deliver it on this. I'll return shortly. Of course. Uh -oh. Put the court into recess. This guy's a fucking CI. All right, come over here, guys. Fucking dirty fucking. What the fuck? <laughs> this is my boss? Are you Stay. kidding me? Marlo's a door boy. <laughs> <Fucking> <laughs> <sir>. <laughs> hey, excuse me, who sir. Who's going to rob me a snitch? That's fucked up, man. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. That was not words from Mr. Rami, so those were words from me to obtain his freedom. Guys, guys, I'm not a fucking snitch, you fucking idiot. Mr. Rami is not a snitch. He's a fucking CI. Guys, listen. The reason why, the reason why I'm, the reason why Tony wanted to give up Mr. K. What? It's not your birthday. Don't talk to me. Yeah, it's not your fucking birthday. Don't talk to me. It's not your fucking birthday. Shut up, bitch. Trying to give up Mr. K, who's not here right now? That's fucked up, right? That is true. Mr. K's not here. I'm talking to uh, Huey Herman. Listen, guys. Mm -hmm. Officers, I am on your side. I'd like to remind you. Oh my god, to this side. Thank you so much. My time was wonderful, and I was reformed. Can't wait and I learned that Rami's you, actions are quite disgusting. And I, do, I wish not the good to side with and him. be against Rami. I can't wait yeah, to fuck Shelly tonight, here. boys. Let me tell you yeah. something. Everybody, we're, we're welcoming uh, anti Ramiers. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna I demand that on the, in, in the hands of the justice system, Rami is to be shot until dead on the steps of the courthouse. What the Darn! fuck? Oh, I, would I love agree. Him. I agree. Hey, real good tonight, boys. Hey, guys, on three. Let's fuck Shelly tonight. One, two, three. You guys are in the minority. Might as well join us. 
All right, it's just two of you. Kill him. All right, now it's now it's just one of you. Kill Rami. Kill Rami. Listen, now it's just one of you. Hey, let's not forget. Hey, boss in the brown jacket. Rami's on this side too. Damn, Rami. Let's not forget. Shelly, she's coming around if you want to talk, if you want to be honest here, Cornwood. Oh, Shelly? Oh, I fuck yeah, Shelly. Shelly's That's what I'm straight. saying. Hey, Cornwood, hey, don't hey. take it anymore. Just hit him. I, 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 punch I, I, him in the Cornwood. fucking face. Shelly's oh, taking there's no, there's yeah, no I've been judging, fucking Shelly since 1974. Hey, my man, I've been doing this since 73. That's what, oh, that's what I'm saying, baby. Go ahead. Do something, bitch. Yeah, go screens. ahead. You, you, Let him have it, Cornwood. You know that. You're real piece of shit. that motherfucker, Cornwood. Otherwise, you're going to keep fucking your wife when you're at work. Oh, I can't, can't reach him. Oh, 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 oh. Lock him up, assault! Oh, oh, all right, all right, all right, hey, 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 all right, guys. Oh, hey, Your Honor, he's beating up my lawyer. Hey, officer of the law. Hey, everybody, be cool. All right. <laughs> you hit. <laughs> Damn, Cornwood, no wonder he fucks your wife. Damn, you hit. Yeah, you know why? Because right, Shelly hits harder. Hey, 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 hey. Separate. Separate. This is an officer on the law, you can't be. Relax, Mr. Separate. Cornwood. Separate. Hey, Cornwood. Uh, Step back. All right, all right, I'm, I'm cool. Separate. Like that. <laughs> Lost my damn well, head. That's the first thing you I'm hit. Could have hit Jesus Shelly. Christ. Sir. Cornwood, I'm going to bet Tay-Tay's hitting <laughs> hey, you like your that wife from behind right now. No, no I'm right here. I'm trying to get my sister. Go to the left. Go to the left. Are you feeling all right? Relax there, Mr. Yo, we have to talk about something crazy. Why? What happened? After this. After this. By the way, that, that CI shit is bullshit, by the way. I, the reason why Tony Andrews calls me a CI is because I'm paying him off, so he doesn't want to let the other cops know that. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Yeah, yeah. All right, listen, Rami. Yeah, what's up? I shot Jack in the face. Yeah, that's fine. I don't care. Okay, good. And also, some security guard Wait, was like, no, we'll that? see if you have your job you after that? this. I was like, motherfucker. That's yes, so sir, funny. Thank you, officer. That's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on, hold on. They're here. Who's here? Yeah. What the? Everybody, fuck? heads down, heads down. Everybody, heads down, heads down. Everybody, oh, everybody. This is, a, this is one of your fucking officers. What is this? Shh, shh, what? Shh, shh. Hold up, you're too loud. You're too officer, loud. They're gonna hear what's happening. Uh, They're coming. What are you? What are you Who's coming, bro? Who's coming? Yeah. What, 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 what are you talking about? What's happening? There, Andrews. Oh, yeah, so I saw Officer Ripley. So I'm over here. So on your on your good side. I can see. I can see. Special. Oh shit! I do hear that. Jesus. Oh, that's Shelly getting hit. I'm not saying you're special. Special. You're hiring. Okay, sir. Now he on your good side, sir. We have to even it out, Spencer. Okay, coast is clear. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Really now, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're all good. It's the area to get that best in, Spencer. Okay, how about in now, that sir? Size? Yes. There you how many are. Vests were so I just wanted to make sure to make like that six. we both Jesus. understand the no hard feelings with our litigation strategies, oh. sir. Finally, a real fucking guess, cop. You know, Jesus, thank God, Trooper now. Hunter. How you doing? Hello, hello. How's it going? How's it going? God, I've been dealing with fake cops the whole night. Jesus, what's going on here? Just a nice bench trial. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I appreciate Ooh. that, sir. I got problems, officers. Are they like no problem, brothers? sir. No problem. Uh, is that Gary Knoxby? Yes, sir, sir, it is. Yeah. So after this is over, I, I, I would ask you to come to and maybe catch a movie, possibly Pirates of the Caribbean, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, reviewing and the maybe events. later, so we could catch a baseball game. Maybe go watch the Los Angeles Dodgers play the Pittsburgh Pirates, sir. I'll be honest with you, Andrew. Not yes, sir. Them. Yes, sir. Uh, dude, dude, fuck come happened. here, come here. And when it's football season, so we could. Bro, this guy Ripley. And jump the shit. Dumb. Wow. Dude, this guy Ripley literally started charging me with like five charges, and he just kept. This should just be evading. And no, dude, it was evading, resisting arrest, bribery, possession of cocaine. Uh, he charged me with a whole bunch of shit, and I just sat in the car. And I was gonna go to jail for like forty months. I was like, bro, what? Like, fuck that. What do you mean? That yeah. sounds all about right to me. I didn't do anything. Uh, yeah. Bro, I you literally were... sat in the car with you. I didn't have a warrant. They only oh. chased. So they, and then he tried saying that uh, we were the ones that, that hit the bank because I know we know I know Uchiha Jones and that Uchiha Jones uh, uh works at the works at the gallery. Like he tried painting this picture that I know that that we were part of the fleet of bank robbery. All right, so it sounds like you're just wasting everybody's time. Uh, no, this guy's trying to charge me for forty months. I mean, in hindsight, yes, I should have just took forty it. months. You understand? I've been out here for like three hours. Yeah, a bunch of shit. Yeah, this is fucking annoying, Mr. Rami, sir. Hey, what's up? 
Yeah, I want to know how you feel about the trial, sir. I'm uh, feeling good. Probably never going to go do another bench trial again, to be honest with you. And why is that, sir? It's kind of a lengthy process. Oh, just Yes, sir, me but justice is a lengthy sir. process, sir. True, that is true. Not wrong. What you say? And you must again? remember, justice delayed is justice denied. Yeah, but you sir. killed it out there for sure, because these guys are dumb as fuck. They, um, you, you had them stuttering for a whole, for a lot. You know what I mean? Why? Thank you, Mr. Rami. That is my strategy, sir, this to is... confuse Mr. and obfuscate uh, the other side, sir. Mr. BJ, I want you to meet my boys. This is Mr. K. Uh, this is Uchiha Jones and Pablo Wealth. These are my friends. It's a pleasure hey, to meet you, up? sir. Very nice to meet nice all to three meet you of both. you, sirs. I hope you enjoyed my legal expertise. Yeah, you're like actually this, uh, like this, really, sir. really good lawyer. Not oh, gonna yeah. lie to you. Why, thank you, sir. All right. I appreciate you having my boys back. He's not the smartest, but he's a good guy, and he's dumb as fuck, and he's a fucking rat. Yeah, I'm not a rat. Only... So I would agree with all that except for the rat portion. Guys, the only sir. reason why Tony even calls me a CI is because I'm paying him off. He doesn't want other other officers knowing that. So he's saying that uh, I'm a CI. I literally haven't done shit. Yes, sir. That was all part of our legal Uchiha? strategy, sir. Yeah. yeah, I did. Say that again, Uchiha? I mean, Kay? Rami, at the end of the day, let's be honest. Mm -hmm. You're yeah. a fucking puss, bro. Yeah, like, I know. You're a puss, bro. Yeah. Know your fucking place, dog. And just <laughs> you stop stepping on my fucking toes. Don't even talk to me. <laughs> don't even talk to me. You said with a fucking dick in your nose, Yeah, you're right. I am a puss, I guess. You are with a puss. Yeah. BJ, am I a puss? Sir, what you are what you eat, sir. Hey, my man. Hey, you I have hair for you guys? Yeah. Oh, you look so cute. For me. You look so cute. What Listen, kind of only the original, the, the, the four people who were uh, thought of the shoddy on the top on the original four for the uh, plan. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the, where are you getting these fucking things from, dumbass? Can you tell the difference between the two recordings? <laughs> BJ, can you? So I did not hear your question, sir. Okay. He's gonna play. We're gonna play two things for you. And can you tell me if you can tell the difference? Listen, only Go the ahead, original, the, the the four people who were uh, thought of the shot on the top on the original four for the uh, plan. <laughs> I I That sounds absolutely sound identical like. to me, sir. <laughs> what the no. fuck? Are you serious, PJ? Sir, I don't talk like that. I can talk clear and enunciate all my words. I noticed that you had to slow down your sentence there to properly. <laughs> Damn, Zad. What the Damn, fuck? Damn, Zad. Aye, Me and Uchiha fucked in the bush to get away from the cops. Yeah, we had some pretty crazy sex. Crazy, thanks for that brand new sub. Oh, it must be nice. I don't know why, uh, uh, uh what's his name? Coyote's taking Why is it taking so long? Yeah, I for real. I the fuck out of my cops and I got away. Ran into the subway. Oh, it must be nice. Uh, they all came for me. Chawa ran me over, and then they fucking tased me, and I got well, caught. That's because I juked him out, and they said, wow, let's just go for the dumb one. Yeah. Oh, he's back. Thank God. Are you the, the thing? Yeah. Verdict. Life in prison. Somebody shoot this bitch. Door. <laughs> <laughs> All rise, honorable coyote presiding. Put this court back in a session. Uh, so I did, I did go over a lot of this. I did read the penal code a lot of this. Uh, to try to break it down. Um. So let's let's start with the re resisting arrest. I'm gonna read verbatim the penal code for resisting arrest out of Ur penal code. Not any penal code outside the city, but Ur penal code. Ur penal code. Here we go. This is what resisting arrest is. Please want a peace officer to avoid being apprehended, detained, or arrested while on foot or a passenger in a vehicle. Fuck. Are you serious? Now, if a, if, if a individual is being chased by a, a cop and you're the passenger in the vehicle, after that chase is over, you absolutely have the PC to detain the person. Do you have enough to arrest them? No. Why do they add that? Do you have enough to uh, detain them? Absolutely. Uh, and per penal code, resisting arrest is trying to escape arrest or detainment. 
So based off of that, uh, Mr. Rum is going to be guilty of resisting arrest. Okay. Uh, and then the fruit of the poisonous tree when it comes to the cocaine uh, is going to go along so stupid. with that me, me, as being invalid because since the resisting arrest does stick, that means the cocaine sticks. Now for the bribery. Um, here's the, here's the thing about the bribery. Actually fucking annoying, dude. And I, and I oh want to make this perfectly God. clear for everyone uh, in the courtroom oh, because there seems to be a lot of a miscommunication when it comes to Miranda rights. Miranda rights are, are there for questioning and they're essentially there for the most part for questioning inside of a, uh, a police department or a cell or somewhere oh, where the person is on the defensive and everything around them is intimidating. That was the whole reason the law was created. Um, I could so, run out. Yeah, the, the, although you you can question someone on the side of the road and Miranda rights start the are car, needed, start the car. The whole the whole point of it is for questioning or for the authority having uh, or the authority having power over you and uh, intimidate you. So with that being said, uh, I'm going to read the definition of uh, a bribery. So bribery is conferrence or agrees to confer any benefit upon a public servant upon an agreement or understanding that yeah, such public servants vote, opinion, judgment, Don't action, fail, decision, brother. or exercise of discretion as a public servant will thereby be influenced. Confer. What is confer? <laughs> I'm sure a lot of you probably don't know, so I'll define that for you as well. Confer to be have discussions or exchange, exchange opinions, meaning that you're opening up to a discussion with the individual about what's happening and what isn't happening. Based off of that, there cannot be any spontaneous utterance, especially since you're in a police station, in a police setting. Two, you're openly having a conversation with the individual where no spontaneous utterance are occurring, and it's back and forth. So with that being said, the individual wasn't Mirandaized, and nothing he say can and will be used against him in this courtroom, so I'm going to find him not guilty of the bribery. I'm going to give him time served for the, the, the time for the other two charges oh, right. and the, uh, the fine that comes with it. This case is closed. So, sir, my client is free to go. Is that correct, sir? Have a good day, Jack. Hey, he he got hey, hold it right there. I got to bill you. What? How much is it? How much Me is it? Clap. Let's see. It's going to be... Um... Thank you so much, BJ. You, know, we you lost. are welcome, Mr. Rami, sir. One th oh, I got to remove the brandishing charge now. So, it's going to be less than $1,800. I'm not sure how much less, though. Just give me your number. I'll uh, bill you after you walk Yeah, out. my number is uh, four. All hey, right. Uh, Kyle, are you sticking around Goes or are you uh, taking off? Appreciate that, BJ. You need me? Uh, I just want to talk to you about something real quick. Yeah, Can I get my gun back? I fucking keep it. I don't even care. I... Appreciate that, BJ. Can, I, can you throw me your number? Yes, sir. Mr. Romney, I'll give you my business card right now, sir. All right. Appreciate that. Thank you so much. There well, you are. So if you'll send me a text message, I have your number, sir. Yeah, I got you. I'm going to do it right now. I'm going to go get in the car and get changed. I need to get the fuck out of these clothes, all right? Yes, sir. Good luck to you, sir. I wish you the best of luck, sir. And if you in need would like to put me on retainer, I'm more than happy to represent you in the future, sir. There you go, brother. I appreciate that. Why, thank you, sir. You have a good night, all right? Get the fuck out of this, dude. I just got out. Is Ramino arrested? Let's go, let's go. Where's the car? Where's where is he? Yeah, he's gone. Did uh They took everything from me, man. Oh my god, give me a sec, let me go back inside. Like I said, they took everything from me. I'm like, I gotta get my stuff back. Yeah, I'm not doing a bench trial anymore. I mean, I guess gotta give RP sometimes, but it was way too slow. It took way too long. Ripley, can I get my stuff back? Good Ripley. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, my what phone, you... oh, literally yeah. everything. <laughs> yeah, let me give it all back. To you. Sorry. Uh, excuse me, Andrew. I just gotta give my stuff back. I don't wanna. Go in your pockets here. 
You're off the hook, Ronnie. Ronnie, make sure you pick your stuff up at the yeah, front desk. He's going to take it away. No problem. Uh, Ripley, can you give him his gun back, too? Uh, yep, it's already given back to him here. I'm just going to make sure he's got his lock fix back. Let's go, Mr. Cornwood. Sorry for taking your time, guys. Excuse me. Excuse me. You're in my I'm way. keeping the cocaine, though. That's not yours. <laughs> Is that everything? Uh, no, nope, but it's fine. I, didn't, I don't think I took anything. Hey, fat ass, get the fuck out of the way. <laughs> hey. Hey. Hey, hey, you watch your damn mouth when you're around me, okay? You, damn mouth. you know what else? Who, you know who needs to watch your mouth? Shelly, what you hey. sucking on my dick. Your masks. Sure. I need to, I need to... Watch I'm where you're going. I'm fuck Shelly tonight, Corner, where you better recognize that. Hey, the fuck you say? Hey, little fucking spitty bastard, come here. Nah, fuck that. I got, my, I got a date with Shelly tonight. Come back here, you spitty bastard. Got a date with Shelly. Did not... <laughs> Did you escape for? No, they fucking charged me like $800. But uh, uh, Cornwood came up to me and was like, you better watch your mouth. I said, yeah, you know who needs to watch her mouth? Shelly, when she's sucking my dick. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, they were set up here. I came out, Dude. I started a bike with and I hopped out. I know. Ryan was on the corner and a bunch of other cops. They tried to pop Bro, uh, me, uh, tackled him, and I booked it. I'm never doing another bench trial again. Never. I, uh, I, bro, you would have the amount of shit I done while you were locked Really? Up. You want to go to the apartments? I have every, I have all the bags. Let's just go. Yeah, let's get the bags. We'll sell them. Yeah. Let's get Uchiha. That's my.